So here's the latest uh, Panasonic ARM processor right here. Uh, so, so who are you? Uh, I'm Stuart Bell from uh, Panasonic System LSI Design Europe. So, uh, so you're launching a new ARM system? Yep, so what we're showing here at um, TV Connect is our PH1 Pro 4 LSI. So it's a dual core Cortex ARM A9 with our Panasonic IPP media processor, an OpenGL ES 2.0 graphics engine, and a variety of peripherals, so uh, for a hard disk drive interface, uh, SD card, gigabit ethernet. And uh, what we're showing it here is uh, decoding a uh, 4K uh, movie from the H.264 uh, and now putting it to the uh, Panasonic uh, 4K panel. So um, 4K resolution, 30 frames per second. So you said that you add your own uh, media solution? Yeah, what so is that? as well as the ARM processor, we also have our own IPP processor which takes care of uh, all of the AV decoding. So does it say something about here? Uh, is that what it is? Or is that yeah, something else? Yeah, that's the name of the chip. So it's called Pro Extreme 1. Um, as well as doing 4K decode, it can also do multiple transcodes. So up to uh, four channels of 720 uh, Full HD uh, transcode. So what does it mean, four channels of 720? So what it means is that we're doing four decodes and four encodes uh, simultaneously. So four decodes, four encodes. That's right. Why? Well, if you have an application like this, um, so what we've got here is we've got four channels of MPEG-2 uh, transport stream data on the hard drive. We're decoding that uh, high bit rate, so 18 megabits per second MPEG-2, um, displaying it directly on the, on the monitor. But in parallel, we're transcoding that to 2 megabits per second, which we can then distribute through our uh, wireless router to uh, tablet devices. So it's a media gateway type of application within a home. So the idea is you decode from a hard drive, for example, hard and drives, you encode yeah. and everything at the same time. Yeah, so you decode from a hard drive or from a satellite, something where you've got a lot of bitrate coming in, but then you want to transcode it to a lower bitrate so you can easily distribute it on your wireless network in your home. So this is not something for professional use, it's uh, just for consumers? Uh, there's lots of uses for this, so uh, it can be consumers, it can be professional use case applications, so for example security DVRs uh, could use this transcode capability. So. Um uh, what's it called? Uh, uh, here you're showing some different demo, or yeah, here here we're showing the uh, the 4K uh, decode. 4K decode. Uh, so this is specifically for set -top box, right? Uh, yeah, set -top box, media player, uh, IPTV, digital signage. I mean, basically anywhere where there's uh, you know video needed. So uh, could it be like a home console? Um, yeah. Some kind of a game machine also? I think the graphics performance wouldn't be strong enough for a games machine. Um, so it's more about the video entertainment side really. And what else are you showing here in this graph here? Uh, so on this one we're, we're showing the, uh, the flow of the data through the system. So we have the, the transport streams on the hard drive going into the decode engine. So there are four decodes. They're being output uh, via HDMI to the screen that's directly connected. We're encoding them, those four decodes, and passing them to a DNA server, and then using a wireless router to a series of four devices. And so uh, Panasonic has been doing ARM processors for a while. Yeah, we have. Uh, I can't say exactly when, but I think we, we've had sort of five or six years of ARM processor-based designs. And yeah. previously, was it also a TV uh, set-up box uh, market? It was, so our primary market is smart TVs. Um, and Blu-ray uh, recorders, devices, um, uh, and yeah. And this is the first time you show uh, the solution, right? This is the first time we've uh, actually physically demonstrated the solution in, in the UK, so we're, we're quite excited about that. Um, and uh, yeah, we've talked to a lot of customers this week, and they seem to uh, you know appreciate the technology.